Hey everyone, this is Roberto Blake and welcome to another Photoshop CC tutorial. In today's tutorial, I've got a special treat for you today. We're going to be previewing one of the new features in Adobe Photoshop CC 2014. This will be a Photoshop CC 2014 exclusive tutorial. So if you don't have the latest version of Photoshop CC, go ahead and get that so that you can follow along with this tutorial and take advantage of this brand new feature. So in previous tutorials, I've demonstrated masking tons of times and it is actually fairly straightforward to mask an image like this if you want to use the quick selection tools and refine edge and so forth. But that could be a little time consuming. Thanks to one of the new features in Photoshop CC, this is actually a lot easier than it's been before. And that new feature is the focused area selection. So if we go to select and we choose focus area, which is a new option from Photoshop CC 2014, and I'm just gonna select overlay, we can go ahead and we can just get what's in focus since I shot this in depth of field with my Nikon D3200 when I shot this. All right, so you can see it actually does most of the work for us. That's actually really solid. And I'm just going to add some things back into our selection that took out real quick. So I'm just gonna select uh, my pen tool stylus here and I'm just going to really quickly paint back in some areas that it took away. As you can see, this is considerably easier than if I were doing this the other way around. And while it's doing that, I'm just going to take away a few things that I already know I can just get rid of before we go to the Refine Edge tool. All right, that looks pretty good. Let's go ahead and go to Refine Edge. I'm just gonna select Smart Radius. Decontaminate colors. I'm just going to run over this real quick and get the areas that the focus area missed. And let's just see how that looks against black. All right, that actually looks really good. I actually don't think I could get uh, that much better a mask with that no matter what tool I use. So that actually looks fantastic. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go with that. Just add a little bit there. Just get one more pass. Sake. Click OK. There we go. And that was really quick. And that's one of the uh, better masks that I think I've seen uh, Photoshop come up with. And of course, we can always adjust this however we want. If there are things that need to be corrected, we can certainly do that. But no, that looks really good for the most part, so. Well, that's it for this Photoshop CC tutorial video. I'm gonna be definitely covering a lot of the new features that are in Creative Cloud 2014, so stay tuned for that. I'll try and see if I can work in some general bonus videos for everyone who doesn't have the new version of Creative Cloud 2014 yet, so go ahead and also stay tuned for that. For those of you who are new to the channel, I do Photoshop CC tutorial videos usually every Thursday. 
Like this video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. Check out the other Photoshop CC tutorial videos on my channel. And as always, thanks for watching.